Howdy, I'm Carrie. I'm Kathy. We're Wyoming sisters and today I have a project share. This is a mini album I made for Kathy for Easter. Um, I made this a few years ago and it's been very well loved by young children. So it has a little bit of wear and tear, but I thought it would still give you some ideas on how to um, make it. I used envelopes. Kathy and I were at a store and they were getting rid of some envelopes and we found a big box at a garage sale. And so I made an envelope mini for a friend of mine, decided to do an Easter one for Kathy. Um, on here it just has a sticker um, and a rub on it says Easter 2012. And then the cover was a uh, pattern paper and then I added um, glossy accents to the flowers. Most of the papers come from the Dilly Dally collection. Um, and then you open it up. Here are, there are some photos in here and there's room. So if Kathy wants to put photos for more Easter holidays, she sure can. Um, and, and then I used some, a lot of photo mats and embellishment that went along with it. Um, this flips open. Um, my parents are kind of shy, so their pictures are just covered up with some post-its. So that just shows us getting ready to have the kids come over. Um, the kids showing up, my mom. Um, I tried to make like the pullouts look like Easter eggs. Kind of like how that, that paper has foil. And there's room for more pictures there. Yeah, the boys really have loved this book to death almost. <laughs> they love this book. There's Kathy looking very cute. There's Cody. Um, yeah, this has been well loved by the kiddos. But that's what they're for. I mean, the nice thing about these mini albums, when you put the pictures in them, the kids actually get a chance to take them down once in a while and look through them. Oh wow, I love how it just folds out. The boy, the, my youngest one, he especially just loves this book because he goes through it and he looks at the pictures and he pulls everything out and he just really loves this book. This insert was from the Tags, Bigs and More cartridge and you can cut it out and it's a mini album and um, it's kind of fun because it has all the little doors that can flip out. So the kids do get it out often because they like to play with the flips and pull everything out. From here on there aren't any more pictures. Those were all the pictures from that year of Easter. So she has lots of room for even more photos. Oh, there's a pocket there. Where did you get these little trims? Because they're like a really hard little... They're um Dilly Dally. They were part of the Dilly Dally collection. Yeah. I got the butterflies that went with the collection and I also bought some of the um, stickers. It, it was part of a deal I got for Moment Cross before they went out of business. Keegan helped me with this one. Um, Ke Keegan is um, my youngest nephew. About the time he did this he was probably, let's see, two years ago he had been four, three. 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 So he's three years old, so he helped me make this stamp. It's a soft pink um, butterfly stamp on a pink background. And so he was able to just help me make a background. Um, and that is another option if you're like us and you have limited resources for crafting products or limited finances or you just want to get the most out of things or make them look more cohesive, you can always um, take a stamp and make a tone-on-tone -tone, um, background. And he did great at that because he was able to make it an actually random I know, they, they did the best job with some of that. And so what, what these are, the trim it just acts as like a little place to hold a photo mat. And then here are some tags. Lots of pretty ones. Where did you get your pretty flowers? They're Imaginese. Ooh, they were so nice because they're so velvety. My friend gave those to me. She she got those for me and Kathy's worth splurging on. So then I don't feel, <laughs> I, I feel like, okay, I can break into my stash and use my mm -hmm. nice things. And these were a paper stack. I'm trying to think. I think it's Springs, Blooms, and Blossoms from Die Cuts of, the, of You. And so they were the matte stacks. So they're already cut. 
Oh, so that gives nice. me a good idea of um, where I can put photos, and that really helps. Yeah, I apologize. This is coming apart, but, you know, this was one of the first minis I made, and I've learned how to make them more durable. Um, and two, to be fair, this has been handled <laughs> frequently by toddlers. Yes, they love to go through all of the books that we have put our pictures in, and the kids, they love to just sit down and look at the books. Which is something to think about in the digital age, like you were saying, Kathy, I kind of don't like the digital age because people don't print off their pictures. Um, people don't print off their pictures as frequently. But when you do and you put them in an album, kids really do enjoy looking through the photo albums. Yeah. And, you know, maybe scrapbooking is too overwhelming, but they have things like Shutterfly where you can do a digital scrapbook. Yeah, you've done a few of those and they've turned out beautiful. Kids love them. Mm-hmm. So this is just a, a project share of the mini album. This is one of the first ones I made. Uh, thank you for watching. I hope maybe this sparked some ideas and was helpful in some way for you. So thank you. Subscribe, comment, and um, we're signing off from the Wild West. Bye. Bye.